GTPS, or Greater Trochanteric Pain Syndrome, is a clinical diagnosis which includes lateral hip pain and trochanteric bursitis associated with tendinopathy of the glute medius and minimus muscles. Tears in this area, as well as snapping hip syndrome in the iliotibial band, are also associated with this diagnosis. Using ischemic conditioning techniques, or ICT, we can use our simplest tools, our hands, to create partial blood flow restriction to the upper buttock or superior gluteal region. Combining this with a stretch, we can initiate a regenerative tissue healing cascade, and here's how to do it. For the therapist working with their patient, landmark the piriformis by placing your fingers on the tailbone and the greater trochanter and finding the center point. Move slightly up and laterally. Here lies the superior gluteal artery. This is the arterial branch that supplies the glute medius minimus, the TFL or tensor fascia lata, and superior part of your IT band. See if you can find a pulse in this divot by digging deep. Move off the artery laterally. This is important as you never want to be right on the artery itself. Push down and glide upward and outward from the axis of the artery. You or your patient may sense an increase in pulsing at this region. To increase the effect of this partial blood flow restriction, have the patient extend their leg, flex their foot, and turn their foot to the ground. Here's how to perform this on your own under a therapist's direction using a foam roller. Place the foam roller on the center point of your glute. This is where the piriformis sits. Leaning your body forward by bringing your foot in front of the other and rolling the foam roller a little higher should get you on the spot of where the superior gluteal artery sits. Flex your foot and turn the foot up. This technique creates a safe partial restriction of the upper gluteal region, which can initiate a hemodynamic healing response in the tissues. ICT can also be used as a digital therapeutic, helping your patients recover from across the screen. Visit stromapt.com to learn more if you are a practitioner or a patient looking to see if this is the right technique for you.